Crises can come in a lot of different shapes and sizes. They can be fiscal crises, losing a funder, or losing government support. They can be personnel crises, some scandal with employees. They can simply be the crises that result from shifts in sociology and in trends in the organizational world. Sometimes crises are more pragmatic. Somebody loses a lease for their office, right? Or a tenant in their building, or a shift in faculty members, or whatever the issues are. They don't necessarily need to be broad societal crises. They can be unique to the institution, but they're crises. And the ability to both run the organization and manage the crisis is something that often suggests to thoughtful executives that they seek outside help. Because what does it mean to manage a crisis, to, to, to lead these kind of important challenges? Often there are media components. How do we communicate our crisis to, the, to external stakeholders and constituencies? How are we communicating a crisis to our own staff? to our donors, to our board. And again, not every crisis is the same, but most of them require a level of outside expertise that it's simply not reasonable to expect that somebody running a not-for-profit organization already working too hard with way more things to juggle than is reasonable to expect to now have to suddenly deal with this crisis uh, or crises as well.